Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky said at a press conference in Kyiv on Tuesday that he was confident the U.S. would not betray his country by withholding crucial wartime funding as Ukraine fights off a Russian invasion that's nearing the two-year mark and showing no signs of abating. We are working very hard on this, and I am certain the United States of America will not betray us and that on which we agreed in the United States will be fulfilled completely. In the U.S., aid for Ukraine has been held up by Republicans in Congress who say it must be paired with tougher immigration policies to bolster security at the U.S.-Mexico border. Senate leaders on Tuesday said a deal was not likely to come together soon. Here's Democratic Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer. We've made important progress, but negotiations have not been easy, and it's going to take more time. One senior Democrat in the Senate said any action would probably be postponed until January. The White House has warned that if not renewed, funding will run out by the end of December. Zelensky said financial assistance was key to Ukraine's defenses and that the nation didn't just need money but manpower. He said the military had requested as many as a half a million citizens to be mobilized into the army, though a final decision had not yet been made.